you repeat, I, 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 I want to, to drink water. Uh, repeat, please. You want to drink water? In, in one second? Like if you if you go for one foot away from the computer, you can't hear no. What do you mean? No problem. It says wages. You pay them wages for enjoying them. For what? For enjoying them. For what? For enjoying them. For what? For enjoying them. Sorry, guys, the city is stuck. For what? For enjoying them. For what? For enjoying them. Did you get it? You pay them wages for sex. The Quran says wages. How much is the wages of your wife? How much you pay her a day? Your wife. Uh, can you please, what, what do you mean by wages uh, in Arabic, please? I didn't understand this word. Lord have mercy. The Quran says, bihi. You see, bihi, he's talking about the vagina. For enjoying their vagina, you have to pay them wages as a must for either. Okay, it means you don't have the right to uh, sleep with them until you celebrate the weddings. It's only what it means. What celebrate wedding? Then? What wedding? Where is the wedding? Do Muslims even have wedding? What wedding, man? You guys have wedding? You make some rice, you put in the foot of it a lot, uh, uh, some meat and 20 men in this room and 5 men, women in this in here and they eat and they go to bed, bang, bang. This is wedding? What wedding? You don't see even the women. Now listen. Anyone some water? Halal water. Honestly, in Saudi Arabia, I, you know, I saw a shoe. It's, it's written in it, made in Italy. It says halal shoe. I was looking like halal shoe. Who's going to eat the shoe anyway? Halal shoe? Okay, things happen. Muslims. Those Western, they knew those Muslims. They, they will buy anything that says halal, even if it's a candle. Okay, we go back to business. If Quran. You pay your wife wages for what? You said for the wedding. This is a lie. Because the wages you pay before you marry her and you pay at the end of the marriage. Is that true? So the wedding is over. Wedding is over. Now it's time for divorce. Your wife, she is getting old. You want to have a brand new wife with zero mileage vagina. As all Muslims do. When they are 90, they go find a girl. She is nine years old. And you want to bang, bang. You pay your wife. Why? Your mind. This money we pay is to celebrate the weddings. Okay? And the weddings should all the people, all the people, neighbors, they should know that we are married. So that our sick, so that our relation must be popular, okay? And at what, whatever, this is less worse than a porn star tube. You when you tip in Google, porn star tube, whatever, this is less worse, okay? Thank you very much. So he agreed that this is persecution because he said this is a, a less worse, correct? He agreed. Thank you, Efron. Oh, Efron. Guys, everybody give Efron a rose. Come on, he deserves it. This guy is sweet and badly. So, you are saying that Islamic marriage is better than the porno stars. So, very close. MashaAllah, brother. So, what is missing for your wife is to be a star. She is porno already, but not a star yet. MashaAllah, brother. Work for it. Ran, man, you destroyed me today. You're mine. 
And please, guys, anyone will laugh at Efron, I'm going to bounce you. Don't laugh at him. Put yourself in his shoe. You will look like an idiot. Hello? Show respect. And better, you know, I, I don't like your teeth. This guy, guys, he's an Arab. He eat, he eat ca carrot, you know, eat every day. I'm Arab, like a rabbit. You know him. His, his breakfast, his lunch, his dinner, you know, whatever you see him in the street, he, he have a carrot in his hand. And even he have a side, you know, he's looking for a Muslim woman to marry him, and he's saying to her, I will give you 40 carrot a day. Why 40? I have no idea. By the way, uh, if wrong, is it true that your prophet, he get the power of 40 men for sex? Is that true? You might. So we decide to change the subject another time. Look, I'm with... Forgive me, forgive me. I don't want to change the subject. I'm coming back to the subject. That's it. Let us stay with the subject. You said the marriage of Islam, at least it's better than porno star. At least, this is what you said. Which means you agree that marriage in Islam is a prostitution. So, we will stay with the suspect. Your mind. Sorry, the sub subject. Forgive me, guys. French is my second language. Your mind, if you're Okay. I will be happy if you defeat me. I will be very happy, as long as you deserve it. By equitable dialogue. Not by red dots. Okay? No problem. So, about when I said Islamic marriage is less worse than prostitution or pornography, I mean by that that we as Muslims, we believe this is ideal. The marriage is the best thing that God brings to, to humanity. Okay? But for you who pretend... But you agreed that the marriage in Islam is the same as a prostitution. You pay your wife for, for, for sex. Your wife is your wife under a contract. This is not a marriage. And by the way, uh, Takiva, she said that nikah means marriage. This is a lie. She's not lying. You know. she, ha she, she doesn't know what she's talking about. Nikah is the physical word, is the F word. The Prophet of Islam, he said, Malhunun nakihu yadu. Malhunun nakihu yadu. Allah curse who do nikah to his hand. Now, do you marry your hand? No, it does not mean marriage, charisma. Don't be stupid. It means the physical action you do. Because if nikah mean marriage, why even Muhammad saying, Allah curse the one who do nikah to his hand. You don't marry your hand. Do you marry your hand, Ifran? You might. Well, you are uncomfortable when I try to clarify my points. You are uncomfortable. You get uncomfortable. You, you, your ego is to like only to explain yourself, but not others. You do everything to love on them. So I invite you to equitable dialogue. Let's talk equitable, okay? Deserve your victory. Deserve it. So when I told you that Islamic marriage, at least it's, it is less worse than pornography, what I mean by that? It's you who pretend. You pretend that Islamic marriage is shameful. But I believe that this it is... You know what? We will go to proofs. Did your prophet allow something? It's called muda, pleasure, marriage. Pleasure, marriage. Is that true or no? You mind? It is no pleasure, marriage. These are the Shia who misunderstand. <laughs> this is in the Quran, man. What Shia? 